Hi guys, in this tutorial I'll show you how to instantly boost your After Effects previews, even on a low-end PC. I'll teach you how to transcode your clips from RAW MP4 to MOV format for smoother playback while maintaining high quality. Earlier, I shared three tips to improve After Effects performance, but those were mostly about upgrading your hardware. This time, I'll show you a method that works on any computer, costs you absolutely nothing, and will help you achieve a much smoother workflow. Let's get started. Here I have an original RAW clip in MP4 format, and I bet most of you are editing directly with files like this. That's why your After Effects feels laggy, and you often wonder why my AE runs smoother even if your PC is better than mine. For a side-by-side -side comparison, I'll drop this clip into After Effects and show you how it performs on my PC. As you can see, the video is fully RAW and in MP4 format. Now let's create a new composition and check the preview in AE. It's extremely laggy, as you can see the preview renders very slowly and can't keep up with the playhead. This puts a lot of stress on both the CPU and RAM, even on high-end systems. Even if I lower the preview quality to quarter, the video is still laggy and basically not editable at all. Let's transcode that raw clip with the right setting so we can get smoother editing while still keeping the quality high. Let's open Media Encoder. Now drag and drop your raw footage into the queue. From the Format drop-down menu, select QuickTime, and then click on Preset. Under Video Codec, click the drop-down menu. You'll see several options, one of them is Apple ProRes 422, which is a great choice because it offers a good balance between quality and performance. However, if your PC is low-end, I don't recommend using this codec, as you won't notice a significant difference in performance. If your PC is high-end, you can give ProRes 422 a try. For those using low-end PCs, I recommend selecting the DNxHD codec. Leave the resolution as it is and set alpha to none. Under Basic Video Settings, click the Match Source button. This ensures that the exported video keeps the same resolution, frame rate, and aspect ratio as your original clip. If your PC struggles with high resolutions like 2K, 3K, or 4K, set the resolution to 1080p. You'll lose a bit of quality, but performance will improve significantly. In my case, I'll select Match Source since my CPU can handle the original resolution. Next scroll down to render at maximum depth and make sure it's enabled. All the other settings can be left as default, just also enable Use Maximum Render Quality, and then click OK. Now hit the green Render button and wait for it to finish. While it's rendering, you'll see that your video is now in MOV format, which we'll be using for a much smoother workflow in After Effects. Once the render is complete, we can close Media Encoder and check our new clip. Before dropping it into After Effects, take a look at the file sizes of both clips. The original RAW video is 197 megabytes, which isn't too large. Now check the MOV file, it's over 2 gigabytes. Yes it's much larger, but that's okay, because the performance in AE will be far smoother. By the end of the video, you'll understand why the MOV format is much larger while the MP4 is more compressed. Now let's drag and drop the MOV clip into After Effects and check the preview again. Set the quality to full and hit the spacebar. As you can see, the preview renders much faster and AE is no longer laggy. The results are much smoother. This is the main secret to a smoother workflow in After Effects. Let me also clear the cache and preview it once more, this time in quarter quality. Of course the CPU and other components matter, but even on high-end PCs, transcoding your clips is essential for smoother performance. Now let me explain why the MOV format is much larger while the MP4 is more compressed and why the MOV is smoother in AE. MOV files are larger because they use less compression and retain more image data, making them smoother and easier to preview in After Effects. MP4 files are highly compressed to save space, but this can cause laggy previews and lower quality during editing. For a smooth workflow, use MOV for editing and MP4 for final delivery. Hope you found this video helpful, thanks for watching and if you enjoyed it, please give it a like.